How's it going? Good. I'm just hanging out. Welcome to Sushi Dog. Located in downtown Providence, just a 15-minute walk from the NBTA station. Sushi Dog has top-rated American, Japanese, and fusion cuisine, and trust me, you'll love it. If you don't believe us, just check our customer reviews on Yelp. Hey, man, haven't seen you in a while. How you been? Bro, it's been forever. Talking to you. Huh? Our amazing cuisine is made by world-renowned sushi master Ao Tanaka. He's our head chef. Ao brings together his love of American and Japanese food at Sushi Dog. Oh yeah. At Sushi Dog, you can enjoy traditional Japanese or our new American Japanese creations, like our hot dog sushi, or maybe you'd like the wasabi dog that mixes together crisp beef flanks with a beautiful Japanese twist. I got a dog. Come down to Sushi Dog, you'll love it. Yeah, we're fine. What are you guys? Huh? Oh. What did you guys eat here? What did you eat? I got a hot dog. Oh, we, we just ate a hot dog. Oh, you want some? We just had it. You guys want some dog? Um, we have to ask you guys to leave. Sorry, don't have to serve my guests. Okay. I'm not done eating. Well, you didn't buy that from us here, so we can't have you eat that. You can't touch me. That's the salt, sir. Excuse me. Are you guys really going to cause an issue right in front of where I'm trying to do that? I don't want to have to call the doctor. I would really appreciate it. Can you please? I'm here with Please, sir. Honestly, step away. Please. Blow it out your ass, man. Hey, Go fuck yourself. Fuck face. Meet me outside, homeboy. I'm finishing my hot dog, lady. Get out of my fucking face. Thank you very much. I'm eating a hot dog. I paid for this. I paid for my hot dog. Blow it out your ass, over here. Like I'm a veteran. I'm a veteran. Don't touch me again, man. Don't touch me again, okay? Thank you. I got shoes older than you, all stars. Next into the tank is Chris, who believes his app will change the way people handle their meat. Did you hear about my new brand new app? It's called Meat Locker. And it's like a place where people who are looking to store their meat over the winter, like big game type of meat, like organic meat, they can uh, store it for like a small price, but we also take a percentage from their meat. Like we get buffalo meat a lot. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, I came here for the investment meeting and I'm looking to like, you know, I'm looking, we can give you like a 20% percentage if you come in on the IPO. Well, I, I came here from California for this meeting. That's fine, thank you. So I come all the way from California for this meeting, right? I come to Providence, Rhode Island. I come to... <sighs> this is how you treat an app developer of the century? I'm an app developer. My app is going to be huge. My app is going to be huge. All right. With one shark out, Chris must try to negotiate a deal with the Starbucks staff by either A, blowing the Ted's move off, B, giving a well thought out articulate pitch, or C, having a full blown panic attack. I just can't have you yelling at the customers. Oh, I'm a customer. Well, everyone's a customer here. This is a community. Yeah. This is a place that the community comes, okay? Of course. And I came here for a meeting. I came all the way from California, of course. and I just get rejected on the spot. I got emails and emails and emails. Right. Emails and emails and emails for my app, Meat Locker. Okay. It's gonna be big, okay? Maybe you won't use it. You're, you know, like you don't own, well, maybe you do own a restaurant, who knows? But someone who owns a restaurant, okay. they can use this app and it will change, it will be like Uber, but for restaurants, but the restaurant, look, listen, look at uh, down the block, we got Bajas, whatever, you know, they're eating right here. There's all, everyone wants the, yeah, everyone's, they got, they got big game. There's a lot of organic places. You know, there's vegetarians on the loose, yeah. but, this is gonna take out all the vegetarians. There's gonna be no more vegetarians after Meat Locker, the app, because everyone's gonna be tasting the tasty sweet meat 
the salted meats, the brined meat. Can I go talk to the woman over here? She's got, she's gonna learn all about my habits. Excuse me, sir, that's not You're kicking me out because I'm gay? I'm in Starbucks at Providence and making this guy This guy's kicking me out because I'm gay? Elias. Elias, call the police, please, right now. Call the police. Guys. They're kicking me out because I'm gay. Yes, they are. It's very clear. Because I and I'm not you know what? I'm pansexual and you're just you're judging me because I look homosexual. I'm pansexual, I'm not homosexual. Excuse me. I'm pansexual. Can you put your hand down, please? It's very aggressive. So you're doing threatening him now. The employees being very menacing. I'm seriously going to ask you. You're intimidating me. I am just asking you. Thank you. Clearly, I'm not kicking you out because you're gay. Clearly, I'm gay. Okay, you're not clearly gay. Anyone can wear lipstick. Anyone's allowed to wear lipstick. And you should learn that in your manual. Just because a man's wearing lipstick doesn't mean he's gay. He could be cis, normative. He could be pansexual. I knew, I knew that Starbucks was filled with fascists like you. Wearing lipstick. Thank you. you think you think fascists can't be homosexuals? Uh, they get no. as a result of this store. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm gonna need to ask you. There's homophobic here. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Please leave I'm sorry, my store. We can't I don't believe in police, and I really don't want to call the police. But unfortunately, I'm going to have to. Don't. I'm not gonna be on that, am I? No. 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 Can't even see me. If you don't sign a release, you will blur your face up. Please and leave my store. We also can't be filmed without permission either. Filming you. Yep. Yeah, this is not supposed to be somewhere in the store. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, she's gonna have an attack. We need to stop. She's having an attack. Cause you... <laughs> guys, she's having a panic attack because you're you're hating me because I'm gay. Pear-shaped woman is homophobic. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we got Kirby on the loose. <laughs> you know those give you cancer, right, man? No. Yeah, like they'll fuck you up so bad, man. You shouldn't smoke. Thank you. It's really bad for you. Thank you. Like really bad. Okay. Take care. You know that. Though. What's your name? My name's Michael. Okay, I'm Chad King. Chad King. Yeah. Nice to meet you. I'm Chad. here to get cancer, right? <laughs> I want to get, I want to get like cancer, really cancer, right? Good for you. Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing today? I'm working. Where do you work? Yeah, I work. I'm seriously working. Can I like be your assistant or something? Can I work with you? Uh, no, we're not hiring. Yet. 